Hello everybody. So this is probably gonna be one of the last little bits of our video here. We're currently walking down the current Barkerville Highway. Highway 26. Oh, oh we got traffic. Literally, right down <laughs> So uh, anyway, just wanna wish everybody a fond farewell. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed what you saw and what we were able to do out here. Right now we're just going up to uh, get all of our gear from our, our uh, sites. Camp's all packed up. All we gotta do is remove the tent. We'll take the tent down. And, uh, but there's one thing that we need God to... <laughs> what? Fucking tags. Forgot the tags. Hey, so anyway. <laughs> That was a little bit of a brain fart there, but uh, anyway, just need to do some fact correcting. When we were in Wells yesterday, we found out a little bit of info about this actual little mining road we thought was a mining road because this is where they did all the mining. But in fact, that road that we were on every day is actually the old Barkerville Highway. Back in the 30s, the old timers used to actually barrel through snow and mud and everything else down this old highway in Model T's. Like actual Model T Fords. I mean, these things were barely rear wheel drive. Skinny tires. Can you imagine driving one of those things through all the mud and snow out here in the mountains? We can barely get but, through uh, it in our four x four. Could you imagine leaving this place behind? There you go, folks. The real Devil's Canyon. Right there is where it all started in the 1860s. Doesn't get much nicer than this. Man, that's beautiful. And what we found out uh, is back in the 1860s, the reason that they found gold is because they were making this highway. And when they were doing blasting between Mount Nelson and Mount Burns, that's when they found the gold. They didn't find a little bit, they found a lot. From what we've been told, over $50 million was pulled out of just this canyon alone. And that was back then. So now who knows how much that means. I, I won't even speculate. But it's gotta be a lot. It's gotta be a lot. <laughs> well, I remember that one ad I saw from the newspaper, the newspaper yeah. article. $67.80 worth of gold taken out of one ton of quartz. And that, and that was spectacular back in the day. That, that was ridiculous. Was it was, that made the news. <laughs> and that's when gold was $2 an ounce back then. Yep. Now it's about 1400 an ounce, about that. but there isn't much left. That's and that's why we're here to prove that it is still there, but man, the work, hard, hard work. And now I gotta put the camera away because I'm about to get soaking wet. Talk soon.